Hey folks, I'm Rick Austin. I'm mayor of the city of Demarest, and I just wanted to deliver just a, a, an encouraging message to you uh, this evening. Um, you know, it, this is a, a time period that's been stressful for not only our community, but for our nation and uh, for our world. And, you know, we certainly live in uncertain times, and you've seen a lot of messages from a lot of people. But one of the things that I want to do is I want to encourage each one of you with uh, a positive message. Um, you don't need me to tell you that uh, you need to wash your hands and you don't need me to, to tell you that uh, at the end of the day that uh, you need to wipe your phones down and you know keep your hands off your face and stay socially distanced. But uh, maybe perhaps what we need right now is uh, an uplifting message um, of encouragement. And so what I want to do is just to uh, tell everybody to, to try to find the good in all of this. Um, you know, we're all sheltered in place. Uh, we're spending more time at home. Um, well, you know, perhaps we're doing things a bit differently. Maybe there's an old hobby that you haven't picked up or a book that you've been intending to read or, or something along those lines, uh, but find the good in all of this. Um, you know, the other thing is, is that you know, we're, we're not certain how long that this is gonna last. Um, but what I do know from someone who teaches medical microbiology on a day-to-day -day -day basis is that 80% um, of the cases of COVID-19 um, are either mild cases or they're asymptomatic. I mean, they really don't understand that they've even been exposed to it. So, you know, take a deep breath, understand that, um, you know, most cases are gonna be mild. Um, and really what we need to do is to protect those that are vulnerable in our population. Um, let's take care of our elderly. Uh, don't necessarily have to go check on them in person, but give them a phone call. See if they need something um, as you make a, a trip to the store. Um, you know, uh, love on your family just a little bit more. Find something to do that gets you outside. We do know that uh, vitamin D is a great vitamin that uh, improves our immune system performance. Um, and, you know, getting outside and in the sunshine is always um, something that lifts people's spirits as well. Again, we don't know what's going to happen. I can tell you that the city of Demarest has a great public safety um, group in both our uh, fire department and in our police department. Um, they are well prepared to handle anything that uh, comes our way. Um, I trust them explicitly, um, and our community is blessed to have them. And so, um, you know, be, be encouraged that uh, the city of Demarest is going to continue to operate. Um, we're con going to continue to give the same types of excellent services that we have in the past. If you're in a situation where it's um, financially hard for you, and we know that there are a number of people that have impacted, been impacted negatively, um, I want you to understand from me that uh, the city of Demarest is here for you. Um, and all you have to do is, uh, is pick up the phone and let us know. Um, we're gonna make sure that uh, you, your services stay on. Um, there's not a more important utility than water, and we're gonna continue to make sure that that flows. Just give us a call and, uh, and we'll do our best to do our part um, to help you through a very trying situation. And I wanna leave you with this. Um, I don't know what the future holds, but I do know one that does know um, what the future holds. I know that he says that uh, there's nothing um, that is going to come our way that he doesn't know, already know about. Um, and he knows the numbers of hairs on our heads or the lack thereof in my case. Um, and so you know, take comfort in the fact that uh, there's a mighty God that is full of grace, that understands every bit of what we're going through. Um, pray for our community. Pray for our country. Pray for our world. Um, pray for the leaders. And um, most of all, uh, pray for your family. And uh, if you need anything, don't hesitate to get in contact with, uh, with me. And uh, I appreciate each one of you. Um, God bless you. God bless our community. And God bless America. And again, contact us if, uh, you, if you have any questions uh, or needs that we can be of service to you. Have a good evening.